Thank you so much for accepting me in the group. My name is Melanie O'Neill and I am a trained makeup artist who was diagnosed with inflammatory breast cancer ten and a half years ago and after a year of treatment and mastectomy and radiotherapy within weeks it was back in my skin. The inflammatory breast cancer had spread to my skin. So I've not got skin cancer, I've got it in my skin now. Um, and I've been on chemotherapy more or less constantly for the last 10 years. So, but, nearly forgot something then, but since November and all the scans, they cannot find the cancer. They cannot see cancer anymore. So I continue on a drug called Herceptin, which is going to keep, which is keeping the cancer at bay. It's not a chemotherapy, it's an anti-cancer drug. I don't get side effects from it. So I am living the best life at the moment. And 25 years ago, I trained to be a makeup artist full time in Manchester for two years and worked for Bobby Brown, which I learned so much from. And now I packed in work completely when I got diagnosed. So now I found my bliss again. I found what I've discovered what life's all about. So I want to share my, um, my passion with everybody else um, and I just want you to know that it doesn't matter if you don't wear any makeup at all as long as you feel good like that I believe for me personally it gives me confidence because I look so much better with makeup on and um, there's a few key staple things that I wouldn't be without I've got loads of anti-aging tips which I can tell you over time um, and uh, yeah, I just want to give a little bit back and follow my passion, really. So I hope you enjoy. Um, yeah, there's anything else I can say. Just watch the video and, and let me know some feedback. Give me some feedback. And if you've got any questions, fire away. So I'm going to do a really basic makeup to help you look and feel better, just using some top tips. Um, today, I'm just going to put all basics on. I've got no makeup on at the moment, but I had my eyebrows tinted, tinted and waxed a couple of days ago. So they're quite prominent at the moment. And that is purposely because my eyebrows fade really quick. So, um, yes, I've had them done slightly darker to last longer. But I'm going to use a few key essential things and I, you'll be able to, to see the difference at the end. So I have a good look at this face now with all the redness, the pigmentation all above my top lip. I don't know if you can see it that that's going to be concealed the redness in my eyes is going to be concealed underneath and on top and i'll show you how
and voila what a difference i feel so much better i look 10 times better and i'm ready to face the world now i'm only walking the dog but i've toned my colors with what i'm wearing um and it gives me loads of conf loads more confidence so i just hope we can do the same for you good luck everyone fire away with any questions you want um i love this so much my passion is in makeup and i am willing to give my advice freely so just let me know if you if there's if you've got any burning questions um anything to do with makeup or cancer for that matter i'll try and help wherever i can <laughs>